Do you want to introduce yourself? I'm Tessa. Tessa. And my name is Jenny, and we are here to do a little activity that might help students who are learning multiplication or practicing their skip counts. Okay. Our tools that we're using here are just a regular piece of paper. We're going to use a marker, and then I have an extra uh, piece of paper here that I'm actually going to just cut some little screens, and I'll show you what we're going to do with those screens here in just a moment, okay? So, Tessa, we're going to do an activity called Disappearing Numbers. Some lines here. Let's see. Let me draw a line. All right, Tessa, can I have you take the marker, and I'm going to have you write the numbers we say when we count by three. So we're going to start with three. Will you write a three there? What will come next after three? Okay, and then can you say the numbers as you write them too? Nine, 12, Good deal. Tell me about how you figured those out. I counted by threes. Counted by threes. Now, did you know all those numbers, or did you have a strategy sometimes when you were? So you started counting by ones to help you figure out. So you kind of went 18, 19, 20, 21. I heard you counting 22, 28, 24. Yeah, and that's a good strategy when you're not sure of them, right? Well, this activity is going to help us to help you feel more confident with some of those numbers. Three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 25, 27, 30. All right, and we're also going to do it backwards because that's good for our brain, right? 30, 27, 24, 21, 18, 15, 12, 9, 6, 3. All right, I'm going to give you one of my screens, Tessa. You get to cover up any number on the board there. We're going to start at 3 again. We're going to count forward. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27. And 30. And 30. Can I have you point to the numbers when you count them? This time, let's go backwards. Let's start right here. 30, 27, 24, 21, 18, 15, 12, 9, 6, 3. All right. I'm going to give you another screen cover up. Any number. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 21. Want to check? Yeah. You're right. Yeah. 21, 24, 27, 30. <laughs> Start up there. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. 30, 27, 24, 21, 18, 15, 12, 9, 6, 8. All right. Well, the purpose of our, we're using these little screens because it's helping to distance the support for Tessa but it still allows her to check her answers when she wants to check her answers. All right. Three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. Feel pretty good about that? All right, try going backwards. 30, 27, 24, 20, 21, 18, 15, 12, 9, 6. I'm noticing you're not having to count this time. Start with, and you chose some hard ones to cover here to start with, didn't you? Those tricky ones. That, oh I'm my goodness. The whole bottom <laughs> The whole bottom row? All right, give it a go. Three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. 30, 27, 24, 28, 29, 30. 30, 27, 24. What do you think? Do you want to check? Should we check right here? I, I got that. You that got that one? one? Yes, I got that. I got that. I got that. And I got that. All right. Well. Um, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-seven, thirty. Good. Can you point to them when you go down? Sure. Thirty, thirty, twenty-seven, twenty-four, twenty-one, um, eighteen, fifteen, twelve, nine. Here's another one. Going in order. Going in order now. Six, three, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-seven, thirty. 
Oh, you're right. 30, 27, 24, 21, 18, 19, 20, 15, 27, 30. Give it a go. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 20, 30. 27, 30. 30. All right, give it a go backwards. 30, 27, 24, 21, 18, 15, 12, 9, 6, 3. All right, I'm going to do a challenge with you. You're going to say a number, then I'm going to say a number, okay? I'll start. We'll, we'll count by threes here. Three. Six. Nine. Zero. Nice job. Look at how you figured those out. Okay. You started off and you were kind of counting by ones here going 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, which is a good strategy to figure out what number it is. But now you were going... Too, I needed time to help. Like those all, of, all of these kind of started... These were easy. So you knew 3, 6, 9. Yeah. But, but then you had a count? Yeah, these got mm -hmm. tricky. And now do you feel like if I turn this paper over, could you count by threes for me? Three, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-seven, thirty. Look at that! High five! Good job. That's a good little thing to keep practicing. Okay. Oh, backwards. Yeah. So this little activity was called disappearing numbers. Yeah. All we needed was a piece of paper, yeah. a marker, okay. and some other paper. And scissors. We used our scissors to cut, and we just made kind of what we call a little screen, right? Mm -hmm. We made sure the numbers couldn't show through this other paper. That's sometimes the tricky part. And Tessa's in third grade, so one of the big things that they're working on is multiplication and division. Um, so an activity like this just helps build up that sequence for her and familiarity with that sequence.